Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome all to 2 euro coin roll hunt number 6. In the previous video we found 10 commemorative coins with the Belgium 2014 World War 1 and the Greece 2013 Plato commemorative coins being the top finds due to the low mintage. I hope that today's batch number 6 will yield another decent amount of commemorative issues that we have never seen yet. And so I will start opening the 3 rolls immediately and check out each of the 75 coins and up close to come back with the results in a short moment for you. Ok, so I opened up the 3 rolls and thankfully this batch number 6 yielded quite the number of commemorative coins. Out of the 75 coins in the 3 rolls, 11 turn out to be commemorative issues, so that's about 8.25% out of the total stack of 75 coins. I'll mention what quantity of coins came from which country, and at the end of the mentioning of these numbers I'll put Excel screenshots for the people interested in those details. Ok, so let's start with the numbers. We have in the upper left corner Austria with 4 coins. Um, I have put a uh, nice shiny coin of Austria on top. But uh, yeah, it's a uh, common one, but still uh, nice and shiny. Over here we have Belgium with 13 coins. We have France with 9 coins. Germany with once again a tower of 26 coins. The country next to Germany is Ireland with 3 coins. Going to the left side again we have the Mediterranean country of Italy with 8 coins. My own country the Netherlands with 5 coins. We have uh, Portugal with 1 coin. And we have another Mediterranean country which is Spain with 6 coins. So yeah, as you can see, Germany is uh, number one uh, again. The funny thing, uh, as you can see, is that Belgium is uh, number two, just like in the previous uh, video, by the way. And I live in the Netherlands, and it's funny that, uh, yeah, um, our country uh, isn't uh, among the top uh, three uh, for example but uh, yeah has only five coins but oh well that's uh, how the yeah things can go so let's start right away with the first commemorative coin it's a belgian one and the issuing year is 2012 it marks the 10th anniversary of the 10 years that we have euros over here in europe as a legal tender Replacing the currency of my own country, which was formerly uh, Dutch Guilders. And the currency of some other European countries. The quantity in which this coin was minted was um, 5 million. And as you can see this uh, has still a semi shiny condition. And is going to be a nice addition uh, to my uh, current 2 euro collection uh, yeah, that I have. A nice one. So the second commemorative coin is from France 2016. The topic is about the European Championship uh, Soccer, which was held in uh, France, them uh, being the host. And I think the bank or the company responsible uh, for sealing these uh, coins in the paper rolls did this. Um, I think they marked the role for some kind of purpose that I don't know the reasoning of to be sure. And since this one was an ender, I think it got uh, yeah, marked for uh, some reason. And I think it's washable, but I wanted to show the original condition from which they came uh, from the paper rolls. And this coin was uh, minted in a quantity of about uh, 10 million pieces of prox. All mintages, uh, by the way, in this, uh, mentioned in this video are excluding uh, numbers for sets and proof. The final of the European uh, Championship uh, was between uh, Portugal and France. And Portugal won uh, in with uh, 0 uh, to 1. And this was the first ch championship uh, title for uh, Portugal. To win um, in their history. 
So the third commemorative coin is uh, also from my friends, uh, 2017. It's the uh, 25th anniversary of the pink ribbon and it symbolizes the fight against that horrible uh, sickness that uh, comes in many forms and uh, sadly visits uh, a lot of uh, families over the world in the form of uh, suffering, uh, pain and yeah, sadly uh, misery. The mintage of this uh, coin is uh, 10 million and we already found one of these in our previous videos about coin hunting. But this one is in, uh, also in a uh, nice condition, so I'm uh, just uh, keeping uh, this one uh, also. And you know, uh, you know, yeah, maybe to trade uh, in the near future with uh, somebody who uh, perhaps uh, wants to trade it. The fourth coin is from uh, Germany, and its uh, issuing year is 2006. It's a Bundesländer series with the state of Schleswig-Holstein. This coin uh, comes from Berlin because of the mint mark A. The depiction is of the Holsten Tor and the gate, the Tor, symbolizes the town of Lübeck, which lies on the sea. And of this coin, 6 million were uh, minted. And this one was also found in a previous 2 euro coin hunt video. But nevertheless, I'm keeping this one also like some uh, other uh, multiple uh, commemorative coins I have, but uh, I don't care because I'm a hoarder. The fifth coin we have over here is also from Germany. The issuing year is uh, 2008. It's a Bundesländer series Hamburg and the mint mark D stands for Munich. This is a commemorative coin which already has been found, but this one is also going in the collection like uh, the one uh, before, to complete a whole series of Bundeländer series issue. And it's also possible uh, for each year uh, to get all five coins coming from uh, five diverse uh, mints, which are Hamburg, Stuttgart, Munich, Berlin and Karlsruhe. And yeah, it would be uh, nice to uh, complete uh, such a series. And uh, yeah, if uh, coins are uh, left or uh, double, uh, yeah, then it's possible uh, to trade uh, with people you uh, might never know in this case. So the sixth coin we have over here is also from Germany. And this is not a Bundesländer series uh, coin this time, but it's from uh, 2009, which has the theme of uh, the European uh, Monetary Union, 10 years of the EMU. It's a topic uh, that we have uh, seen already uh, quite some uh, times in uh, the depiction of uh, other coins. And it's a person uh, merging uh, into the Euro symbol. And uh, yeah, all the countries uh, have the same uh, depiction, uh, but the coins have their own uh, respective uh, language on it. And of this coin, uh, 7.2 million were minted. The seventh coin we have over here is uh, from uh, Germany 2015. The theme is uh, the 25 years of German uh, unity. This coin uh, comes from Stuttgart because of the mint mark F. The theme is uh, like uh, said the 25 years or 25 jaren Einheit with the depiction of the Brandenburger Tor. The TOR stands for uh, the unification of East and uh, Western Germany or uh, symbolizing uh, this unification. And this one was minted in a quantity of uh, 7.2 million pieces. And this one uh, yeah, has a nice uh, shiny uh, patin condition. So uh, a nice addition to the 2 euro stack. Germany also provides commemorative coin number 8 which is in the uh, Bundesländer series 2015. This one is the state of Hessen with mint mark D standing for uh, Munich. The depiction is of the St. Paulskirche in Frankfurt. And this coin was directly, by the way, behind the Hamburg uh, commemorative one. Sorry, I don't uh, have that on camera, but it was uh, quite uh, 
yeah fortunate to find two commemorative coins uh, behind uh, one and the other and of this coin 6.3 million pieces were minted oh. the ninth coin is an Irish coin and the issuing year is 2009 the theme is one uh, that is uh, familiar it's the 10 years of the European Monetary Union but then the Irish version so like mentioned earlier each European country has the same symbol So it would be nice to complete this European Monetary Union uh, theme with all the European countries that issued them. Subscribe and hit the notification bell to follow me on the diverse quests to complete this and other commemorative series. So in this case we're gonna try and complete the European Monetary Union uh, commemorative ones. And this Irish 2009 uh, coin was minted in a quantity of uh, around 3.8 million. The tenth coin, which is a um, yeah, semi-shiny, no, it's not a semi-shiny, it's a little bit shiny. This coin is from the Netherlands and its uh, issuing year is 2007. The theme is the 50th anniversary of the Treaty of Rome. This is also a commemorative series which we will turn into a quest on this channel to uh, get all the different issues of the Treaty of Rome uh, per uh, European country. And this one uh, was minted in a quantity of about uh, 6.2 million pieces. And the final and last uh, 11th coin is also from a country. This is one we already uh, have seen a couple of times in our 2 euro coin hunt videos. So it's from uh, 2013, the announcement of the abdication of the throne by Her Majesty Queen Beatrix, followed by her son uh, King Willem Alexander in uh, 2014. This uh, coin has a mintage of 7.2 million pieces and uh, yeah, that were all the 11 uh, commemorative uh, coins. So uh, yeah, wow, that was an excellent uh, run in uh, batch number 6 in regards to commemorative issues and it uh, has given me uh, much joy not only to dig through the paper coin rolls but also to put all the information together and to put this out in a video for you out there who are also interested in special 2 euro commemorative coins so let's continue this positive commemorative issue journey which batch number 7 in next week subscribe to not miss the next 2 euro coin roll hunt video and of course I'd like to invite you to have a look at other 2 euro coin hunt videos on this channel or to check out some of the other silver coin videos as a suggestion. Hope you liked the video and if you did, please like at the bottom of the screen. Stay safe and healthy, be blessed and fortunate and have a magical day.